Hey folks, Rob here for the Card Podcast, and uh, got a box of 2010 Tops updates and highlights to open from Tops Cards. So I want to thank them for this. Like every product this year, we say in every review, this product, uh, hype wise, was based around Steven Strasberg. Then his arm blew up, and the prices of the products kind of blew up as well. How do we do in this? Some great stuff that you can pull in it, like the all-star patches that we've focused on on the site. Um, you know, there's the manufacturer bats that have been maybe not my cup of tea, but they've been popular. And of course, there's the Strasburg rookies. So let's get to the break for the card podcast. All right, folks. Uh, welcome to our live break portion of 2010 Tops Update Series. I've seen this design in a few sets with the Pro Debut, Series 1, Series 2, but with this includes some of the All-Stars, stuff like that, and of course everything this year. Value-wise was kind of determined by Steven Strasberg. In it you get a box topper of one chrome refractor card, so let's open that and see what it is, and then we'll get to the packs. It is Kevin Russo of the New York Yankees. When the heck did he play? Played five ga his first five games, but a whole bunch of different positions. So let's just get right to the packs. We got Derek Lee, Russell Brannion, Jordan Smith, Anthony Salma, Slama. John Boker, Home Run Derby Champion, David Ortiz, Joel Hanrahan, Rookie, Danny Valencia, Tales of the Game, Triple Billing, Only Triple Header of the 20th Century, October 2nd, 1920. My wedding anniversary. And Hanley Tops Attacks. Going to open a few of these packs now, then I'll break the whole thing. We'll come back, give you a review of what we got. Mitch Moreland. Jeff Supon. Iwamura. Logan Morrison, rookie. Octavio Dotel. Matt Thornton. Vernon Wells. Jason Donald, rookie. Rogers Hornsby, Vintage Legends, and Mike Leak, Tops Attacks. J.P. Aaron Sipia, Elvis Andrews, All Star, Padilla, Jeff Clement, Hanley. And Jose Reyes, All-Star card. Andy Pettit, All-Star game. Hanley from the All-Star game as well. Here's a Turkey Red, Honus Wagner. And Tales of the Game, the Mile High Humidor. And Tops Attacks, Cano. You know, it's been a real nice set for Tops this year. Um, this set may not have been received quite as well just because there's so much printed. So much demand at first because of Strasburg, Mar Beltre, Kelly Shopik, Brian Stokes, Jose Tabata, Max Scherzer, Trevor Plough. Nice picture on that one. Gold, Tulo, and Matt Holiday. Former teammates and million card giveaway. Ryan Howard attacks. Sounds wrong to say. Tops is finally making cards of them. <laughs> Brian Mattis, the Razor exclusive is over. Jose Batista, home run winner. Xavier Nady. All-Star Game Ichiro, 
name your Molina. This one's Benji. Ronnie Belliard. Mitch Talbot. And a turkey red of Chris Granderson. And the mom, card your mom threw out. Rookie reprint of Carl Yastrzemski. We're going to open the rest of these and we'll be right back with the hits, folks. All right, folks, and we're back. Here are the cards that we pull, pulled. Just going to go through a few at a time and uh, show you what we got. The biggest thing with this set really is the Steven Strasberg cards were what drove the value originally. I hit a checklist with Strasberg, the Mary Strasmus one with him and uh, Pudge Rodriguez. I hit a turkey red Strasberg. And I hit what they did with... Uh, a lot of the rookies, which I thought was cool and added value to the product, a rookie debut, Steven Strasberg, where it gives details on his debut. I had a few of those with the two Starlin Castros, and I had a gold rookie debut and a regular base of Mike Stanton. A couple other cards I found pretty cool. The All-Star Home Run Derby they did, the pictures from the Derby, so there's David Ortiz winning the Derby. Hit one of the SP of the vintage players, although I don't, I, I don't think I'm young enough to call Bo Jackson vintage, or old enough actually it would be. But here's the uh, Bo Jackson, which I was psyched because he was one of my favorite players as a kid. This card I got for a card that your mom threw out, I found pretty cool because it has a story on the back that uh, Lou Burdett actually put one over on the photographer when he posed for his card. He grabbed Warren Spahn's glove and modeled it as a lefty. So he's here as a lefty, but he actually pitched as a righty. Also, his name spelled wrong. Somewhere on the card. And card, let's see what else. Card that I had a little bit of an issue with is this one here. Card your mom threw out. If your mom threw out a card from last year, you should be having a talk with her. Here's a card that hurt a little bit to see. This is the uh, See You in September. Victor Martinez and Robinson Cano. Red Sox didn't make the playoffs. Card I found pretty cool was uh, Hayward in his All-Star uh, warm-up jersey. You know, nice, nice to see a young rookie. Um, he was hurt, but they did get a picture of him at least there. He didn't make the game, but he was uh, voted an All-Star. Card that hurt me to pull a little bit because I turned it over, saw the borders, thought I had a platinum. Nope, just had a card your mom threw out. Barry Zito Ben Sheets. My hit for the box was a John Buck All-Star warm-up jersey. And one card I kind of kind of laughed at is the uh, Pujols and Ryan Braun. It says the machine and the hammer. Well, after the World Series and uh, his recent success, I think you can call this man, or this man at least, is related more to the machine. Fact. Brian Wilson. Cleats. Check how sweet those cleats are. Awesome. And the last card I have, which I found really just a cool picture, is the turkey red of Rod Carew. So thanks to Tops for sending this box out for us. Hope you guys enjoyed the break. I'm Rob Zeta. We'll be right back. Alright folks, we're back. Uh, thanks to Tops again. Box probably wasn't the greatest box ever of uh, updates and highlights. Didn't hit any of you know, the big hits. But that's what you get with a product like this. It's really low odds to hit something really awesome. This card still pisses me off, though. Looking at that border, pulling it out of the pack, I'm like, I got a platinum. No, not a platinum. It's thrown away. Thanks to Tops. Visit them again online, Twitter, slash Tops Cards. Rob from the Card Podcast. Visit us online at www.thecardpodcast.com. Also, one thing that we're uh, working on starting little uh, side project is a uh, message board longwhitesoffreedomcardboard.com but about comic books so if you're interested in all in comics try out comicbooksboard.com slash forum we're in a beta stage where we're trying to figure it out looking for some new readers I'm Rob Zeta thanks for watching visit the card podcast visit comicbooksboard.com Visumfreedomcardboard.com Best of luck in all of your future endeavors.